and welcome to another Finley YMCA workout. Today I am bringing you an arm and core workout and all you will need is a mat or a towel and yourself. So we're going to go ahead and get started. We're going to come on down to the mat. We're going to aim each move depending on what we're doing and I'll let you know as we go. It's going to be about 30 seconds to a minute. Um, and like I said, all about those arms and core today. So we are going to start down on our mat and down on our knees as well. We're going to walk on out. Find that nice plank form even on those knees and we're going to start with the tricep push-up. Here we go. We want to keep those arms nice and close to your body and think about those elbows lifting that waistline. So they're nice and close to your body, coming down, pushing up with those palms. Got it. Hold that core in. You're almost there. You're almost there. And then we're going to flip it on over. Keep that form. Give me one more. Good. Flip it on over. On over to your bottom. You have crunches. Let's go get down. 30 seconds here. And they're quick transition. That time's not stopped. You got it. Bring those arms up or just a gentle behind your head. Try not to pull in that neck. All right, we're flipping back on over, coming into that push up form again. This time, I want you to bring those hands wide, come on down to your push up all the way down, and you're going to come up halfway and sink it down. You're already 15 seconds in. Remember that, that clock is not stopping. You have bicycle crunches in five seconds. Woo! Here we go. Flip it on over. It's quick. I know, I know. Bicycle crunches right here. Opposite elbow to opposite knee. You can speed it up or you can go nice and slow and controlled. Make sure to get that twist in there. Come on. Breathe through it. Breathe through it. Good. Keep going. Come on, push yourself. Less than five seconds. All right. Hop on up, but we have a tricep dip. Put the right leg, lift it up. So remember, right into it. But those fingertips are facing your bottom. And of course, you can always come right here. We want those elbows pressing back. Lift in those arms. Lift in those arms. You got it. Breathe through it. We're going to flip over. Give me one more. And flip on over right here. Find a high plank. Nice and controlled. Now we're climbers. Keep going here. You're driving that knee in. Of course, if you want to pick up that speed, go for it. Otherwise, nice and controlled. Exhale. Exhale. Got it. Those wrists are right under those shoulders. Come on. There you go. Go to work. All right. We're going to come up on those knees. Bring those arms out to a T. And right here, just arm circles. Catch your breath. You can stand. You can sit. Whatever's more comfortable. But I want you to engage those core muscles. Right here. Bringing them forward. Bringing them forward. Keep those arms lifted. Keep them up. Strong arms here. And two, one, take them backwards. You got it, you got it. We have crunches after this. Woo! Starting to feel it. Keep them up, keep them up. This is a great workout to do before or after a walk or run. It's really quick, but it gives those arms and core. Almost there, almost there. Woo! I'm feeling it, I'm feeling it. All right, let's find that crunch. Flip on over. Here we go. Remember, you want to think about crunching up to the ceiling to keep that neck nice and long. Good. You have a plank in 10 seconds. And 
another minute move is coming here. Here we go. Find that plank. Find your plank. You can go high plank or forearms here. Hold here. I want you, though, to think about making your base a little bit wider with those feet. Breathe through it. Get ready. We're going to add something on. Breathe through it. Hold that plank. Come on. Keep that bottom down. All right. Right here. Plank shoulder taps. You're going to tap that opposite shoulder. Tap. Tap. We want that wide base to keep from swiveling those hips. Come on, you guys. You are almost there. You can do this. You can do hard things. Come on. Get it done. Get it done. Less than 10 seconds. Come on. It's fast or slow. You can always just hold that plank, too. I know you can do it. Awesome. From here, I want you to slowly bring yourself down and find a Superman. And then come up to that plank. Hold. Come back down. Come on. You're with me. You're with me. Remember that clock's not stopping. So we're going between plank, back and forth between plank and Superman. Yeah, less than 10 seconds. A little pause when you get to both. And then do it. Transition nice and controlled. All right, right here. Straight leg presses. Bring those legs up. Crunch up to those toes. Woo! We're going to find a plank after this. Less than 10. Come on. Crunch. Crunch. Reach up to those toes. All right. Find your plank. We have a walking plank. I want you to go right, right, left, left. Right, right, left, left, back and forth here. Nice and controlled. Breathe through it, breathe through it. All right, flip back over, crunch is here, crunch is here. You can keep those feet on the ground or up. We're up at 90 degrees, up to you. We have tricep dip, tricep <laughs> dips next. Left leg lifted this time, or opposite leg. You did that first time. Almost there, almost there, you guys. All right, tricep dips. Remember, bring that booty up. Left leg up if you got it, and you're dipping down. Working those triceps. Breathe through it. Breathe through it. You have 10 seconds. We have bicycle crunches next. Lots of crunches. Give me one more. Good. Come on down. Nice and easy. Opposite elbow to opposite knee. Let's go. Crunch. Come on, you guys, come on. We're going to flip it over next. You can find a down dog position. You have 10 seconds. Breathe through it. Get that twist in. Keep that neck nice and long. You got this. All right, right here. Find that down dog position. I want you to bring those fingertips in towards each other, and you're coming down into push-ups right here. Keep going, keep going. I want that crown of the head to come down to those hands. Come down to those hands. Bend in that elbow. You got this. You are so close. That bottom is up in the air this time. All right. Flip it on over crunches. Last time. Last time of crunches here. And then we're going to find a minute plank. Come on, breathe through it, breathe through it. You are so close. Two, one, we're 
right here. Find the low plank. Low plank. We're on those forearms. You got this. You got this. You got this. Hold it here. Just hold for now. Clear. All right. Tap those heels. Go back. Push. Push. You got it. Just hold. Just hold. Keep that bottom down. Right here. Focus and recheck on that form. How are you doing? How are you feeling? Stay strong. Just breathe. Squeeze everything like heck and breathe. Right here. Tap those hips. Go down. Down. Right. Left. Right. Left. Right. Left. And bring those knees on down. Bring that bottom back to those heels. Keep those arms out. Extended. Hug your head. Breathe right here. Take a deep breath right here. And then very slowly. Come on up nice and tall here. I'm going to face you. Go ahead and bring those arms on up with your inhale. And let it go. Good. One more time. Great big inhale. And on your exhale, reach to one side. Inhale back to center. Exhale to the other side. Inhale back to center. And let that go. One more time right here, you guys. And let it go. Awesome, awesome job. I know that was quick, but like I said, it's a good workout to either add to the beginning or end of a walk or run, just a little extra punch. Awesome job. I feel like we just pushed play. So awesome job. Thank you so much for being here. Take care.